Hi, hello, and welcome to Knowledge Cube TN. And you are watching the aquarium series. Angel fish is a kind of fish which is loved by all fish breeders and fish lovers. You may be thinking of how to break this angel fish. If so, this is the right place for you. This is the part 1 video of angel fish breeding. Part 2 and 3 are available in the description of this video. See all the three parts to get cleared in the breeding of angel fish. Before starting the video, if you have not subscribed to our channel, subscribe to it. And if you like our videos, give a thumbs up and share it to your friends. Now let's get into the video. Part 1 of 3 Setting the right conditions for breeding. Step 1 Set up a freshwater aquarium large enough to prepare breeding angelfish. Try to choose a tank that is at least 20 gallons 75.7 liters and ideally 29 gallons 110 liters large. Your angelfish pair will do best with plenty of space. In cramped quarters, angelfish won't feel secure and will fail to breed. Try also to place the angelfish in a tank that is tall. Mature angelfish can grow up to a foot long from their dorsal to their anal fin, meaning you'll want to accommodate their unusual length. Step 2. Test the pH of your water. In their natural habitat, freshwater angels live in soft water that's slightly acidic. For best results, make sure that their aquarium water has a pH of between 6 and 8.0, with the ideal range being 6.5 and 6.9. Angelfish are relatively hardy when it comes to pH and tolerate a wide range of water conditions. But, you want to try to shoot for this happy medium in order to produce a contented breeding pair. If your water isn't in the ideal pH range, a deionization filter or reverse osmosis filter can do the trick. These are usually attached to your main water supply, and can run from fairly cheap to incredibly expensive. They are, however, effective. Try not to use chemicals to alter pH if at all possible. Chemical pH solutions alter the alkalinity or acidity of the water much too drastically, something your angels are sensitive to. Angels may fail to breed or, worse, die off if the pH swings too drastically from one extremely to another. Ensure that the aquarium water pH doesn't change more than 0.2 per day. Step 3. Set the water temperature. Again, because angelfish are very accommodating fish, they tolerate a pretty wide range of temperatures. But they do thrive when the water temperature is right in their wheelhouse, between 78 degrees and 86 degrees Fahrenheit. That is 22 degrees and 27 degrees Celsius, with 82 degrees Fahrenheit being a good target. Keep in mind the trade-offs of different water temperatures. Warmer water is arguably better for immune system of angelfish, whereas colder water increases their lifespan. Step 4. Put a good filter in your aquarium. Angelfish are ideally suited to strong currents, so be careful about using a high-flow filter, which could tire them out unnecessarily. Better to use a sponge filter, gravel filter, or both, that way, your angels will have energy for love and their small fry won't be sucked up into the filter when they hatch. Do at least 50% water change each week either as part of regular cleaning activity. Step 5. Feed your angelfish properly. Angels typically aren't very picky eaters, but they do enjoy their fresh foods and generally have very robust appetites. Shoot to feed your angels at least two or three times a day, being careful not to overfeed them. Give your angels three to five minutes to feed on any food you give them. Any food that hasn't been eaten after five minutes should be removed from the tank to promote clean water. If introducing a new kind of food to your angels, 
don't feed them at all for one or two days. Then, when you do introduce the new food, provide enough for one or two bites, supplemented with regular food. This should be enough to get them excited about the new kind of food. A regular diet may consist mainly of dried snake food, supplemented with brine shrimp and blood forms. Live food, apart from brine shrimp, isn't recommended for angelfish because of the chance of disease. That is all, is the part 1 of this video. Other two parts are available in the description of this video. Check the description and watch the other two parts fully. Before that subscribe to our channel and if you like our videos, give a thumbs up and share it to your friends. Thank you for watching.